Rocky Musabi, the first Pullman sleeper car. Let's head to the bridge where we'll have a better view. <laughs> have been cut. We've got to stop the train, Tonto. Sure save this train. I've had nothing but accidents on my service to Denver. A railroad trip might help us find out why, Mr. Pullman. I don't know. A masked man riding on a train? I'll be riding in disguise. Tickets, gentlemen. Denver. That's a mighty dangerous route for you two to be taken. Dangerous? My friend isn't used to violence. Don't worry, modern trains are as safe as riding a horse. All right, everybody, reach for the sky. I told you, gents, this route was dangerous. <laughs> Another rich businessman on the Denver Pullman. Just drop your billfold in the bag. You heard me, city slugger. Drop it. No, gunman. You drop it. What's this? A smart-talking passenger? No, amigo. Just a quick thinking. <laughs> Gunman wouldn't say anything, but it doesn't add up, Tonto. There wasn't enough on this train worth robbing. Hmm. Unless he just wanted to scare passengers away from using the Pullman car. Kimosabi, we're slowing. This doesn't look like an Indian arrow. And they don't ride like Indian braves.
for taking care of that engine trouble while I was sleeping. The trouble wasn't Indians, Conductor. These two are plain bandits. But why? We'll leave that to the sheriff to find out when we get to Denver. Those bandits could never have attacked the train if it wasn't going so slow. It was that new conductor. He told me to slow down. Said he had to check something outside. I think that new conductor's got some explaining to do. Pullman Express from St. Louis now arriving. I'd like to speak to you. You've got some explaining to do. Traveling in disguise. I think you're the one with some explaining to do. Those fake Indians could only have attacked if they knew the train was going to be slowing. You also said you were sleeping, except you had fresh mud on your feet. Good thinking, masked man, but you forgot one thing. What's that? This. up, Tonto. I'm going after the conductor. Mr. Pullman, I guess that conductor won't be bothering your sleeper cars anymore. That was no conductor. He was Wes Mahoney, a foreman at my factory. I caught him stealing and fired him. He was out for revenge and hired those three outlaws to help him. Thanks for your help. Anytime you want to ride a Pullman, you just let me know. We'll do that. Who was that masked man? That was the Lone Ranger. Fire Silver! Away! The railroad brought settlers west and helped tame the frontier. And thanks to the Pullman car, which allowed passengers to sleep in comfort, it made long-distance travel practical. <laughs> <laughs> 